This video is for all the professionals working on the profile of textile fiber and yarn, hide and pelt processing machine operators and workers and are willing to migrate to or work in Canada. It will provide you an in-depth knowledge about the National Occupational Classification Code of Textile Fiber and Yarn, Hide and Pelt Processing Machine Operators and Workers. So, let's start the video. Hi, I am Smith and welcome to our channel A2Z Immigration Updates we make informational and latest news videos regarding global immigration. Watch this video till the end and don't forget to subscribe and click the bell icon, so that you can get the most updated immigration news and information. In Canada every skill profile has a unique code that is called National Occupational Classification Code or NOC Code. This code tells us about the detailed information associated with a profile and regarding the key parameters like Profile Description or Profile Lead Statements Key Responsibility Area and Main Job Duties Employment requirements. Alternative and illustrative job titles. Job titles in exclusion. So, first of all let's see the NOC code and its description for the profile of this video. The National Occupation Classification Code or NOC code for the profile of textile fiber and yarn, hide and pelt processing machine operators and workers is 9441. As per Statistics Canada, the profile description of textile fiber and yarn, hide and pelt processing machine operators and workers is as follows. Textile fiber and yarn processing machine operators and workers operate machines to prepare textile fibers, spin, wind or twist yarn or thread, and bleach, dye, or finish yarn, thread, cloth or textile products. They are employed by textile manufacturing companies. Hide and pelt processing machine operators and workers trim, scrape, clean, tan, buff and dye animal hides, pelts, or skins to produce leather stock and finished furs. They are employed by leather tanning, fur dressing, and leather and fur dyeing establishments. Key Responsibility Area Human Resources and Skill Development Canada has defined a proper set of job roles for every NOC code. There is not any fixed guideline for meeting all the requirements. As per the recommendation of experts a person should meet at least 50% of the job responsibilities, mentioned in the NOC code. Now let's discuss the key job responsibilities associated with your profile. So, here we go. Main job duties of an textile fiber and yarn, hide and pelt processing machine operators and workers are as follows. Operate and feed machines that wash, mix, blend, pick, card, lap comb or draw fibers and finish yarn. Operate spinning, twisting, winding, or reeling machines. Operate a variety of machines to bleach, dye, coat or finish fabric, thread, yarn, or other textile products. Mix dyes or chemicals according to established formulas. Operate machinery to print designs onto textile products. Oversee work area, examine products for defects and ensure adherence to quality standards. Investigate machine stoppages and notify supervisor or mechanic in the event of equipment malfunction. May set up machines and assist with maintenance and minor repairs to machinery. Hide and pelt processing machine operators and workers perform some or all of the following duties. Operate machines or use hand and powered cutting knives to remove unnecessary particles from hides, skins, or pelts, shave or polish hides, and shear fur or wool hides to produce pelts with hair of specified or uniform lengths. Prepare solutions according to pre-established formulas and immerse hides, skins, or pelts to clean, de-hair, pickle, dye, oil, tan, soften and preserve. Adjust rotation and mixing action of vats according to state of pelts. Tint or dye furs to enhance natural shades of fur. May maintain and repair vats and other machinery. Employment requirements and other additional information. In this section we will discuss the employment requirements for your profile. Every job has a specific set of employment requirements associated with it. The main employment requirements factors includes. 1. Type and level of formal education. 2. Specific training or apprenticeship. 3. Experience in the same or other related occupations. 4. Licenses certification and registration to practice in a regulated profession, extra. 
Before moving further, let's understand the employment eligibility requirements and other additional information associated with your profile. Following are employment requirements for the profile of textile fiber and yarn, hide and pelt processing machine operators and workers. Completion of secondary school may be required. On-the-job training is provided for periods up to several months, depending on the complexity of the process and the number of machines operated. Every job role or employment can have multiple profile titles. So if you are not able to find the exact job title for your profile then you need not to worry. Now we will see the list of illustrative and alternative titles for your profile. This section is a list of titles commonly used in the labor market. We will also see the exclusions list that is the list of titles that cannot be covered under your profile. So let's have a glimpse of it. Illustrative titles for the profile of textile fiber and yarn, hide and pelt processing machine operators and workers are as follows. Autoclave tender, textile manufacturing. Bleaching range operator, textile manufacturing. Calendar operator, textile manufacturing. Carding machine operator, textile manufacturing. The list is quite large, so, if you want to read all the alternative profile titles then you can pause this video and can have a proper glimpse. Now let's see the exclusion list. Master Dyers and Textile Color Technologists, C2211 Chemical Technologists and Technicians. Supervisors, Textile, Fabric, Fur, and Leather Products Processing and Manufacturing, C9217 Supervisors, Textile, Fabric, Fur, and Leather Products Processing and Manufacturing. So, this was all about the profile of textile fiber and yarn hide and pelt processing machine operators and workers with NOC code, 9441. We at Brain Drain Consultants Private Limited helps you to migrate to Canada on work permit or on PR. Our motive is to convert your immigration dreams into reality. We assist you in Canadian style resume and cover letter preparation. Mapping the best employment opportunities with your skill set. Employment consultation and job search. Online skill profile preparation and branding. Education Credential Assessment Filing Canada Migration Skill Assessment Filing Australia Expression of Interest EUI Filing LMIA Work Visa PR Business Visa Filing If you need any further information then you can contact our team of expert registered migration and employment consultants Our team will help you to explore the employment work visa and other immigration opportunities for your profile in Canada and Australia Click on the booking link mentioned in the description to reserve an expert session for a detailed discussion to explore your immigration opportunities. We also assist employers to file LMIA with Employment and Social Development Canada ESDC. So if you are an employer in Canada we can help you to get the best manpower for your company. Canadian immigration is a merit-based immigration process and your selection under most of the immigration programs depends upon your age, education, experience. English language capability, spouses educations and experience, employment availability through LMIA, provincial nomination extra. We at Brain Drain Consultants Private Limited provide a one-stop online platform with all kind of immigration services for our global customers. You can have online consultancy sessions, assessment application filing and all kind of visa processing assistance by our team of experts.
If you want to do a self-assessment and check your eligibility for immigration, then click on the link attached in the description and download our app to do your immigration assessment yourself. Also watch our other videos related to work visa filing and finding a job in Canada from your home country. So, if you like our video then don't forget to subscribe, like and share our YouTube channel. Also hit the bell icon to get the most updated information regarding global immigration. Thanks, and we will meet again with one another informative video soon.